Hi everyone! And welcome to Pop and a Bar. Where we drink something and eat something. And we don't know what it is. Today we are in Seattle. Seattle area. It's not Seattle, Seattle proper as I've learned. It is uh, <laughs> Seattle improper. Uh, where <laughs> we are now going to. Don't uh, think you can say that. No, I can't say that. No, well, I'm you sorry. just did. Uh, oh, and there's people. We, uh, we're getting something, and I'm very, very curious. Our, our lovely friend Anna Maria prepared something, so we're gonna see. Here we go. We're, we're not gonna read it, right? No. Well, try we reading it. You can try read it. it. You can try and read it. Yeah. Well, I, I can. I could read it. So here we go. Oh, oh I, yeah. I couldn't read that. That's interesting. Beautiful. So, opening it up. Bo, you get first dips at drinking it. Oh, this baby. is a dog hair. <laughs> <laughs> Very unlikely. Mm. Apple. Apple? Yeah. So it's apple cider. Apple. Oh, no, no, it's not cider. Of course. 13. It's not cider. Uh, apple. <laughs> It's not apple. <laughs> it's sparkly, and that's nice. It's apple. a pop. You say apple? Yeah. No, it's. It goes into. I want to say nectarine. Mm, um, better, yeah. Better. Yeah. Better. We have. Um, oh, how about um, a plump? Something like oh. that. Oh. It's refreshing. Yeah. It is not that sweet, although it has sugar. I think it's a Oh, pop. there's pictures of it. It's pictures. Yes. Oh, we, we would call this an apricot. Ume, which is often mistaken for plum, is a unique fruit with high content of natural organic acids, minerals, and vitamins. So it's good for you. Both beautiful and aromatic. It's known <laughs> as a healthy fruit in Japan, and it is a seven in Portland, uh, in Seattle. Is this a seven out of ten? I would say seven. so. An eight. An eight. Oh, you like that's, it? That's, that's like a very it. good rating. Wow, that's very good. It's a very good rating. Okay, yes. well, this is our pop. Do you want something to yeah. wash down with this? No, it's the other way around, but yes. <laughs> well, good luck. What is this? <laughs> uh, Okay, it's like noodles. Yeah, it looks like noodles. Well, we'll have noodles. <laughs> it's a quick bar noodle-ish that I can't open. There we go. Hold up your hand. <gasps> noodles! <laughs> Do we need to cook this first? Well, <laughs> now it's too late. <laughs> Ooh. Uh -uh. Oh, this is nice. Well, this is good. Is it? But it looks like noodles. I will uh, put it in. You really are attacking this like you haven't eaten all day. <laughs> oh, how good. Yeah. Mm-hmm. 10 out of 10. This is so good. <laughs> 10 out of 10. <laughs> it's a bit spicy. No. A bit. But what is it? Oh yeah. Um, oh yeah, it, it is a bit. It spicy. even says <laughs> mild spicy. That's what it says. Um, it's so good. It says mild spicy, tapari beans, flour noodles, flour noodles. Flour. This so, so this is not to be cooked, to, but to eat like this. Okay, our expert Plain says uh, oh. yes. You can eat it like that. It's really nice. It's so good. So it's ten out of ten. 9.5. 9 9.5? Mm. Okay. Yeah. It, it's, it's different. I give it an 8. <laughs> well done, Seattle. <laughs> Rocking this. Um, although, of course, uh, these ingredients are... This is Indian. And um, the, the soda is... Maybe Japanese, Japanese I believe. Right? I would say. So, thank you, Seattle, for importing these. My name is Dave Luza. My name is Bo Luza. You've been watching Pup and a Bar. Send us your stuff and we'll taste it. Bye.